To get Gimme Ghoul into Pokemon Go now, it's probably pretty obvious, but you're gonna need a Nintendo Switch and uh, Pokemon Scarlet or Violet. So here, from within your game, this is my Pokemon Violet file. I'm gonna hit X on my Nintendo Switch, so that's their controller. I just wanna be specific. In that menu over there, you go to Poke Portal on the right side, and from there, you just select Mystery Gift. After that, connect to Pokemon Go. You're gonna see the little text on screen right here that guides you through it. Essentially, what you need to know is that you pair with the Pokemon Go account, and then you connect the Pokemon Go account, and you can do this once per day. If you're wondering right here, you have to press A. They don't even tell you, but like you have to advance it with A. I was like pressing B and all this other stuff. So there we are. We'll kind of go in between our Pokemon Violet file and then our Pokemon Go, of course, that account. And so pair with a Pokemon Go account. That's what we'll do on the Switch. But then over here on the Pokemon Go side, you go into your settings and it's very close to the bottom. Connect to Nintendo Switch. So you'll just do these at the same time and you're going to see on your Switch it says an account was found. And hopefully it's the right name. I don't know why it wouldn't be. But yes, we're going to connect on in there with our Pokemon Go. So right here, if you're just kind of waiting and you're like, okay, I'm going to press connect to Pokemon Go on the Switch, and it just says searching for Pokemon Go account, like you could wait so long until you get this right here. It says no Pokemon Go account. That's just because this is basically the process now where it's waiting for you to go to your Pokemon Go. To get Gimme Ghoul in Pokemon Go, the process should just be like as simple as sending a postcard, but no, we have to go through all these kind of like small hoops, but here we go. I'm going to go ahead in our postcard album that's in Pokemon Go, find one that you're okay losing. You're you're gonna get rid of it from within your album and after selecting a postcard in that bottom right that's the icon that we used and so you just advance through the menu right there so yes okay let's do it it does happen mostly fast so i don't think you'll be waiting for like too long but i did just cut out a small bit of wait time here in editing you're gonna see in pokemon go we got the coin bag so that's available and then of course i'll let you guys see what happens here on the nintendo switch obviously you're gonna see this on screen so it was a happy day you get all those gimme ghoul coins and stuff on your pokemon scarlet or violet and a few other things so now you're ready make sure that you get the free gold box that's in the shop right now in pokemon go that's going to give you a few more of these gimme ghoul coins you're going to need a lot of these gimme fool sucks man to get the golden go you got to get 999 coins that's insane from the item bag you saw me select coin bag and of course you just hit open after that they're going to spawn it's it's akin to the mel metal box if anybody use that somewhat similar to incense as well they spawn pretty fast right here like 2946 right that's i think when we saw this one show up 2945 maybe on that timer it starts with 30 minutes and so i catch my first gimme ghoul right there they are pretty easy to catch so you probably didn't need the ultra ball or anything it was just the first one so there we go registered to the pokedex and so beyond that the other thing you should know is you should definitely be out right now spinning the poke stops because for a limited time some of these are gonna be golden right now and you don't even need a golden lure so in the future we're gonna get a golden lure and that sparkly lure is gonna make the poke stop gold the golden poke stop gives you more items but it's also how you're gonna get those gimme ghoul coins but here's the thing if you know this from previously when they had golden poke stops in pokemon go they're not always gonna give a coin like every single time so you'll likely fill your bag space before you have i don't know more than five depends on your bag space i guess something else you should know is that you do need to be moving now listen i i, I wish i could have stood around and wasted time for science just to fully test this but i did make sure to wait and like stand still to see if they would spawn at the same rate no they do not like i was sitting here seriously for so long until the point where i was just like no i don't want to miss out on gimme ghoul spawns right now and i'm gonna tell you someone can correct me in the comments and whatnot but they definitely don't spawn fast but i wonder do they even spawn at all if you're standing completely still now me moving at a slow or even a high speed driving as a passenger of course you guys that makes the gimme ghoul show up like immediately look from standing to moving it actually took just like a second or two so i think that was around 22 30 next one i saw come up at like 21 45 so it really doesn't seem to take too long and there's not really a big fanfare when you end you know it's not like daily adventure incense so you don't see some kind of post that says how many you caught or anything but you can rarely get coins from catching them so that's one way spin the poke stops do the free box apparently adventuring with gimme ghouls your buddy is going to do it as well and for those of you on twitter you should go ahead and check out these posts right here this is just just gonna get you some stickers uh, but I know you guys want those right 